One of the biggest areas advance in engine design is diesels. In the last 15 years or so, they've improved enormously from the slow, clattery things they used to be. And probably the most significant step forward recently has been in the field of direct injection diesels. The first to combine multi-valve cylinder heads with a small direct injection diesel engine are the engineers at Opel in Germany on their Ecotec TDI 16 valve. Manufacturers have been using four valves per cylinder for some time in petrol engines. They improve the fuel airflow within the cylinders to allow more efficient burning of the mixture. By combining this feature with direct injection technology, Vauxhall Opel have optimised the efficiency of their diesel engines. Currently in 2-litre form for the Vectra and Omega, and from the spring in 2.2-litre form for the Sintra, the new engines are at the forefront in emissions control, thanks to high injection pressure made possible by the new head design. Aided by an integrated platinum-coated oxidising catalytic converter, the emissions are approximately 20% below the EU96 standard. Emissions of nitrous oxide are reduced further due to 45% of the exhaust gas being recirculated to the combustion chambers through a special passage in the cylinder head. All this extra efficiency makes for improved performance over previous Opel diesel designs to further reduce the image of diesels as being slow and cumbersome. There's also the added refinement of balance shafts on the Ecotec diesels fitted to the Omega and Sintra models. With VW in particular pushing the boundaries in recent diesel development, the Ecotec signals that Vauxhall Opel don't intend to be left behind. Overall, the new Ecotec diesel promises much and we look forward to comparing it with older designs in a future programme.